It is that time of the week now where we uh, take the absolute nicky out of each other. Well, we definitely do that, Ooh. TJ. One of the best interviews we've had, I reckon, this year was Dylan Moore last week. Yeah. I thought it was fascinating. Like, he's really strong, mm. defensive his club, had yep. a bit of a, a crack at Damo or those of us that had questioned whether they were trying to win or not. But the best part of the interview was this. And enjoy your break and uh, you're welcome here anytime. Thanks, Chompers. Chomp, chomp, chomp. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> did not see, see that coming. <laughs> so, yeah, we didn't, we didn't see that coming. But it had me thinking. I thought, you know, it, it, it's, it's dropped off a little bit. With what? players, you know, having a crack at you. I think they're a bit scared of you. You're a bit, bit grumpy and they're, they're a bit frightened. Well, when they call me chompers. So we had to go back and we've compiled... Oh, no, don't show this. Yeah, we've, is... we've compiled the chompilation. Why would you show this? We'll look forward to seeing you on the footy show at 8.30 tonight. Thanks, chompers. <laughs> Righto. Thank you. Remind us not to have him on again. Yeah, thanks for having me, Chompers. No worries, Chompers. Cheers. What were the odds? Good work, Chompers. No worries. Cheers, Chompers. Really didn't think you'd go there. But... Thanks, Uncle Chomp Chomp. Thanks a lot, Chompers. <coughs> thanks, Chompity Chomp Chomp Chomp. Yeah, getting back to your form. <laughs> thanks, Chompity 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 Chomp Chomp Chomp. <laughs> <laughs> I'm told he's a very nice man, so I, I doubt that uh, Ben will go down that what? path. Oh, sorry, I, I'm, I'm just trying to work out why you would show that. It's just the chompilation. It's it's chompilation. chompilation. I like that. that, that is chompilation. Good. That is, there's a lot of people laughing. Yeah. Yeah. We, we need to camera. We need to get them all laughing. I can't see anyone laughing. I can't see anyone laughing. OK, let's keep the laughs going, because, hey, we've, uh, we've spoken about Kane and uh, his son. Lost football by 119 points, the same margin they lost the grand final by. So this is this is the game. <laughs> in the third Kane quarter, was so disappointed, so oh, disappointed slap. in his sons. Yeah. And uh, we, we, we've got some exclusive vision of Kane at a local <laughs> soccer game this week. So this is this is the length he's going to. So here's his son, and he kicks a goal, and there's Kane on the side, just trying to help out, just trying to help out there on the side. <laughs> Very good, mate. Uh, now, um, <laughs> as we know, the, uh, the Carlton Draft, I reckon, has been one of the real success stories over the past few years. This is where Carlton Draft go and get old-time champions and uh, insert them into country football areas. Um, oh, I know that... Uh, now, OK, Bernie Vince yesterday was playing for Maryborough. Look at that, 36 disposals, <laughs> eight, eight goals, goals. <laughs> nine behinds. That is amazing, Bernie. Well done, Bernie. Well, well done, Bernie. Bernie. Inaccurate. Could, could In play. fact, if we look at some of the other stats, you'll see some of the other stars who pulled the boots on. Uh, there's Bernie. Josh Kennedy, look, 40 disposals. Jordan yeah, Lewis, 25. Six goals. David Mundy, six Money. goals. Jordan Lewis didn't and, of course, it. our own Kane Corns. What was your contribution? <laughs> Tag a 17-year-old. <laughs> <laughs> You're a good. disgrace. No, I'm not. It was good. It was a tough day. Out Bernie there. had more goals than you had yeah, kicks yeah. in your game. Yeah. Well, I mean, he could have been a bit more accurate, though. Eight, nine. <laughs> <laughs> hey, um, it was all about Trent Cotchin this week in the lead up to game number 300. And back in 2008, it should have all been about him as well when he was about to play his first game of football. But the interviewer on this particular occasion had other ideas and made it all about himself. I'm here with last year's number two draft pick, Trent Cotchin. Now, Trent, it can be pretty daunting walking into a football club for the first time with all these big names around. What was it like to meet me for the first time? Yeah, look, Brandy, it was pretty intimidating. Um, thought so. <laughs> Shower time, very daunting. Big boys down here, you're washing away. Is there anyone better at shower time than me? Yeah, most of them are. Don't really mean that, do you? No. You think so? Thanks for joining us on the footy show, Trent. You've enjoyed spending some quality time with me, haven't you? Yeah, whatever. Wake up. <laughs> Good stuff. <so. laughs> that went to air. <laughs> <laughs> and we had to cut some stuff out that did also go to air. I tell you, when Damo came in the office and he goes, uh, TJ, yeah. can I just get, uh, can you just have a look at this? And I said, no, you've got to cut that out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We're definitely cutting that out. That looked nothing like Trent Cotchin, did it? It looked like nothing like Nathan Brown, too, given how smooth his, his uh, forehead now is. And that back then it was that a few more wrinkles. Looks younger now. Now, TJ, Kane showed vision of you earlier at Wimbledon last year. Oh. And... Uh, 
just miserable. Just miserable. <laughs> Absolutely miserable. <laughs> Everyone would kill to be there and you're... But, you know, this is vision of you. Uh, I think Daryl Braithwaite's around <laughs> in the air. Yeah, look at everyone smiling in the background, that happy. And look at you. Yeah. This is you at a concert. <laughs> this one just flat as a tack. Like, what's going on? Miserable. There's <laughs> you at the heart of it. Clemson, I have a lot of people now saying to me, what's he like? Like, is he happy with anything? Like, uh, like and it's like, even it's like, like instead of weekend thing. at Bernie's, it's like weekend at TJ's. Like, that's how bad it is. You're just like, you're here, but you're not. And it happened again, it happened again during in the week. There's a, everyone's excited over the swimming carnival. Oh. Everyone's trying to qualify. And look at you, TJ. You're just oh. miserable. Just a miserable human. And then you grab your mobile phone and just flap it doesn't over and just there. don't want to be there. A lot of people, someone filmed that for me and sent it to me. So yeah, I've got a fair idea. There. I've got a fair idea. And then they had that. a big Channel 9 reunion. So everyone got back and went back to Bendigo Street. Oh, yeah, well, the Bridge Hotel. Yeah. The Bridge Hotel. And here, look how happy Joe Hall and Hitch and everyone is. <laughs> And there's another shot. And then look at, TJ. look at the meat sack TJ in the background there. <laughs> Just folded arms, miserable. The person, <laughs> this person's sack. telling an engaging story and you're just folding your arms. Just TJ, you just, are miserable. You've Hang got on. a great life. <laughs> and you're just flat as a tack. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> a, a miserable human. Meat sack. Meat sack. Meat sack. <laughs> you're there, but you're not. You're there. <laughs> Hang on. The I've, been in, I've, been ins I've been insulted by the best of them, but never before have I been referred to as a miserable human and a meat sack. Meat sack. <laughs> so I probably took it a bit fast. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Absolutely you have. <laughs> when I'm bowling in cricket and someone's not fielding well, that's what I call them, TJ. A meat Will sack. you stop being a meat sack and take that cat? Uh, so sorry, TJ. <laughs> Throw to the break, meat sack. <laughs> All right, you listen, don't you start, mate. All right, I'm not joking. Who? Uh, uh, he only did it once, but. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to take a break here on the Sunday Footy Show. That's, that's quite harsh, what I've got to say. He's still laughing.